Ninja Warriors, today we are going to talk about all those books which will help you to secure your seat in either top IITs or NITs, right? But before I just tell you clearly that these are the books, let me just talk about very important thing, a common mistake with which all of J aspirants are making since so many years, right? And that mistake is, suppose right now I will tell you that these are the set of books, these are the best books, then what you will do is, you already have some set of books with you and now what you will do is okay you will say that okay maybe these books are not that good books and what ninja Mav is telling are those best books so let me just ditch it and buy a new set of books and follow that and maybe after like 15 days 20 days you get another recommendation video wherein you will see okay so that teacher that youtuber is telling me some another books and now let me just ditch these books so you what you are doing over here is you keep on changing the source that is the common and biggest mistake in any j aspirants journey okay so let me just reveal one important alert before i just give you what are the best books that alert is two or more incomplete books is way too less than one complete book one complete book, that one complete book will give you that confidence that two or three incomplete books will not give you at all. This is your confidence breaker and this is your confidence booster, okay? That is first thing. Do not change your source at all, okay? Once you can do, maybe you are, you have bought one book and you are not able to like, you are not able to, you're, you are not liking that book a lot. And once you can do, but throughout the year you can't keep on changing your source right once it is allowed maybe you're not liking that book, particular book or something like that but no book is worst book no book is best book first of all let me be very clear one more important thing which i'm which i want to tell you before even starting with the books if you are enrolled in any coaching or if you are having any coaching material i am talking about good coaching material then a good coaching material module plus previous year questions will be more than enough to secure 1000 thou rank. Yes, under 1000 rank I'm, ta I'm talking about. So this will actually, this is more than enough under th for under 1000 rank, all India rank, okay? But, but there are some students, all India rank, yes. There are some students who will be like, okay ma'am, we are actually solving a coaching material along with PYQ, but we still want to keep one book along with that. So you can just watch this video towards the very end, till the very end. And also I'm gonna give you a bonus tip related to PYQs, bonus tip. And that bonus tip will be in the very end. So stay tuned with this video till the very end, okay? All right, so coaching material plus PYQs, if you are having, then I will tell you that what is that one additional book for each subject you should be keeping. And if you are not going to the coaching, then I will tell you that what to do, okay? Both case scenarios I will do, right? Okay, so let us start with physics first. So in physics, you have to keep NCRT, you know that for, because NCRT is very important for your boards examination, right? And if you are a dropper, then also you know that you have studied NCRT in your class 12th as well. So this is I am already taking, I am assuming that you already have this. Now there are two scenarios. One, the first scenario is that uh, you uh, have coaching material plus PYQs. So trust me, coaching material plus PYQ is more than enough. But still, you if you want to keep one book, that one book is going to be HC Verma none other than HC Verma. Yes, you have to solve HC Verma questions, okay? But the second case scenario that you're not going to the question, uh, coaching, then PYQ so definitely is must. But that one book will be HC Verma, so you have to keep no second thoughts. But now, HC Verma is not having much questions, right? You need something which is replaceable to this coaching material and that book is going to be either Sengage which is written by B.M. Sharma or you can just pick Arihant. Whichever book suits you, both books are good but you have to stick, stick to either of these two books, right? You can't be jumping. You can't keep changing the source, okay? So either Sengage or Arihant if you're not going to the coaching. So if you're going to go to coaching, then this set is enough for you. If you're not going PYQ plus HC Verma, you have to keep 
फॉर रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ कोचिंग मटीरियल फ्रेंगेज और अरिहंत यू कैन पिक दिस इज ऑल अबाउट फिजिक्स नाउ केमिस्ट्री इट इज लिटिल बिट ट्रिकी केमिस्ट्री इज लिटिल बिट ट्रिकी वाई बिकॉज वी आर हैविंग थ्री सेक्शन इन केमिस्ट्री ऑल राइट सो फॉर ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री नाउ केमिस्ट्री के लिए लेट मी जस्ट गिव यू वन मोर अलर्ट दैट एन सी आर टी वी वी ऑलवेज नो दैट फॉर केमिस्ट्री एन सी आर टी इज मस्ट सो फर्स्ट थिंग एन सी आर टी इज मस्ट विच आई हैव नॉट रिटर्न ओवर हियर बिकॉज एन सी आर टी आई एम अज्यूमिंग दैट यू नो दैट दी हाउ इम्पॉर्टेंट एन सी आर टी इज ओके ऑल राइट दैट योर केमिस्ट्री टीचर्स ऑलवेज टेल यू नाउ फॉर ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री आई हैव दीज रिकमेंडेशन राइट कैन यू सी ओ पी टंडन एंड दीज टू बुक्स राइट this is for organic chemistry right again i will say one same thing if you are going to the coaching then ncrt plus pyqs plus your coaching material is more than enough right but if you are not going to the coaching then pyqs plus ncrt is there and these three books are recommended books for organic chemistry same goes for physical chemistry right you can see the recommendations for physical chemistry and you can see the recommendations for or inorganic chemistry now for inorganic chemistry ncrt is like way more important than organic plus physical so for inorganic that's why i have written over here you have to have to refer cbse like ncrt book and along with that if you don't have any coaching material then you can just refer to either of these two books okay all right and now let's talk about mathematics please let me be very clear in mathematics because this is the most trickiest part so in mathematics what happens is uh basically so yes the very first thing if you are focusing on coaching material plus pyqs then you are doing absolutely right if i if you are sticking to that i am super duper happy okay so first priority is good coaching material plus pyqs if you are doing that okay now but there are some students who want to keep one book with this okay you who want to solve one book with that and second kind of students who do not go to the coaching or who do not have coaching material then what what we should do i will tell you this okay so coaching material plus pyqs now can you see the recommended books objective mathematics volume 1 and 2 rd sharma is one book theek hai all right and then sengage so sengage or arihant so these two books are almost similar in terms of like a uh, number of questions you can say and uh, the the pattern also a slight different there is, there are similarities slight difference is also that so you just can go and just check out those two books sengage or aryant if you are confused between them and you just can see that what kind of like you get the feel of these two books right and you just understand that okay this book is actually attracting me the the pattern and the like whole uh, scheme and the segregation of this book i like sengage or some of you might like arihant also by the way let me tell you sengage is more popular than arihant i am talking about the popularity not about the which one is good because both books are really really good equally good but sengage is more popular um, among students that's what I, the information i want to pass on and but the catch is what is the trickiest part that can you see that sengage ke liye we have can you see how many are 1 2 3 4 5 5, 5 books are there for sengage okay and same goes for arihant as well right so the point is if you feel ki okay i will solve coaching material because maths is going to take much longer time in solving as well you know if it is taking long time in your twin, uh, like examination that means it requires long time in your preparation also right if you are solving questions it will take more time than physics and chemistry if i talk about in purely in terms of solving pyqs and coaching material so already you would be occupied in these two okay so please do not set ambitious goals okay see so yeah, that i will be able to solve coaching material plus pyq plus this book because these books are like uh, having so many questions right so if you still want to keep one book so either you pick rd sharma right or pick sengage or arihant so pick any book but again now you won't be able to solve all the questions from these books so what you can do is suppose in sengage you can just in the beginning you can just focus on jain in problems 
and that to solved example problems. So you just can focus on solved example first because you don't have to do a PhD in one chapter. If you feel like, okay, I am ambitious, ma'am, I will able, I'll be able to solve all the questions and then you will, you might end up in like, what, suppose you pick quadratic equation and you are just doing PhD in quadratic equation, other chapters are neglected. We don't want to do, do that, okay? All right, because you would be getting only one question from quadratic in your J main, maximum two, okay? So you have to make that balance. So first of all, let us take the pledge, okay? So I'll solve coaching material, then PYQ, and if I get time, I will, my first priority will be all solved examples. And if even if I'm getting more time, then my second priority will be selected questions from single correct. Okay, so like this, you can just develop your strategy. And if you're not going to the coaching or you don't have any good coaching material, then PYQ is must do. This you cannot like, this is irreplaceable. And you have to pick one book. So I will recommend either Adi Sharma or Sengage or Aryant. You can pick any book. So pick any book and just uh, solve each and everything related to that book. But again, if you talk about Sengage, again, you might feel a little overwhelming that Maybe, ma'am, I'm not able to solve the all questions from um, Sengage. So, again, you can build your strategy that, okay, I'll solve solved example. Solved example first to build that concept and confidence. And then plus single correct type questions I will solve. And if I feel, okay, I have bandwidth for this subject, then I will solve other questions as well like numerical and all. And if not, I can just move on to the next chapter. So this is all about mathematics in detail. Okay, all right. Now, there must be some students who will be like, okay, ma'am, my mains is sorted. I feel I'm very confident that my mains is sorted. Please tell me something about J Advanced. So for J Advanced, we have some amazing books for physics, chemistry, and mathematics, especially for J Advanced. And on the top of that, you will get uh, pattern based questions as well like multi select question numerical type matrix type question in these books and the link related to this particular book is given in the description box that is first thing and also yes so can you see the rating this is on amazon as well so you can just check out the ratings as well on amazon itself uh, j advanced rank accelerator books you can just type so you will get this and also one more information i would like to give Yes. So yes. So I I always focus on PYQs. So this is where you get your PYQs from J Main 2022-2023 chapter wise previous year questions book. So your priority should be 2024, 2023, 2022 like this. Last three years should be your first priority. And if you are done, you can just go back to 2021 then and maybe 2020 as well, right? And from here. J advance rank, oh, so these are the J advance rank accelerator books which you can just click on the link which is given in the description box and here you go okay all right and here is the bonus tip for you all so the bonus tip is related to PYQs and you all must have heard from all the teachers that solving PYQ is a must must do task but if everybody is if every student is solving PYQ then where is the differentiator so the differentiator lies in how you are solving the PYQ. Yes, how are you solving the PYQ? So basically, I am talking about all those PYQs which are not memory based and not too direct, okay? So I'm talking about all those PYQs which involve some concepts, which involve some uh, calculations as well, right? So these type of PYQs should be solved at least twice, yes. So be it 2023, 2022, 2021. So this should be your priority order. That is the first thing. And each and every PYQ at least twice you should solve. And you should solve it till the very end. Till you get the answer. Because some students what they do is okay. Uh, I am not able to solve the question. All right. Maybe I just go back and look at the solution. And I look at the solution and I'm like hmm. Now I know. Okay, let us move on to the next question. This is not the right way, my dear students. So the right way is, okay, even if you have looked at the solution, now pick the pen and start solving till you get the exact value. Suppose x equals to 3. So x equals to 3, you should be writing in your notebook and tick that particular answer. So please complete the end-to-end -end process which you would be doing in your J main examination. 
this important tip will actually boost so much of your marks i cannot even tell you okay so this is the bonus tip and all the important links are given in the description box i'll see you super soon in the next video